This is Twit. There's a new company called Gray Key. Have you guys been paying attention to this? We've talked a long time about Celebrite. Bit, yeah. And mm -hmm. Celebrite, of course, uh, required law enforcement to send the phone to them. They would send it back with a hard drive full of the data on the phone. This new company, Gray Key, made by a company called Gray Shift in, uh, out of Atlanta, it's only a few years old, claims that they can unlock any kind of iPhone, even an iPhone 10. And furthermore, law enforcement can buy the device and keep it at their place. It's a gray box. Yeah, two models. <laughs> two models, just right for you. You can connect up to two iPhones at a time. It takes about two minutes. At that point, they're not yet cracked, but sometimes late, sometime later, the phone will display a black screen with a passcode. In other yeah, words, it takes it's longer put for the six digit and even yeah, longer for the password. It puts but something on I the say, phone. I will say that I'm, I, I'm, I'm pretty certain that Apple is really glad that someone posted all these photos. <laughs> <laughs> figure, out, figure out like where it's coming. And, and also, I wonder, like, you know, Apple's got some cash. I don't know why they don't just go to Gray Shift and go, billion dollars. Like, let, let's just buy you. <laughs> Take your engineers. Well, I mean, because there's always there's always another exploit. So uh, presumably, like, this I, is an exploit, right? This is taking advantage of a flaw in iOS. No, but, but you want right? those it's, guys. You want those guys working for you. That's true. That's finding you know, other yeah. flaws. Number one is you close this down. You close this down, and then you and then you bring those guys in, and you figure out what they know that 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 you don't know. Um, it'd be worth a billion dollars, I think, to Apple. I mean, typically you know, it's to, a chain you know, of exploits, and this, like, th th that this is a box could mean, for example, like, just so they, I'm just spitballing, could be an example that they're using a USB based exploit as the first level of this, and then they're escalating it through something else. Um, and Apple, yeah, Apple has a crack team, a red team of security people who are all over stuff like this, but it, it happens. It's that cat and mouse game where people find vulnerabilities, there's a huge market for it, people pay a fortune for zero day exploits of things like iOS and Android. And then you'll see this come up and then it'll be fixed in another update. And then, you know, the bad guys or the law enforcement companies will work again on cracking them. And that's how it goes. I, I mean, this, is, this, I think, at least is fair game. When, when the government starts to mandate backdoors, I think that's incredibly dangerous. But if they're going out and trying to hack their way in, I mean, that, that's how they do their oh, I think I think it's fair game. I think it's totally fair game. I think that this is, this is I mean, it, it, it's something that hopefully we can all hope that Apple is going to close. But I think that that in the same way that I, the government doesn't have the right to ask Apple to give them the information, the government has the right to do whatever yep. it can to get okay, the information out. So I, I don't I don't have any is, problem with it. 